Hey guys, welcome to the 2 a.m. pipe on the patio. Today, I'm smoking Tracy Mincer Doodler for the first time. This one I got from uh, Mark over at Tobacco Pipes International. And this is the first smoke out. I wasn't sure I wanted to smoke out of this one or not, but Mark had it looking so dang pretty. It looked brand new. But I decided pipes are meant to be smoked, so. And in it, I'm smoking Mylon Tobacco's our sugar barrel. A great little tobacco. This is a tobacco that I like to put in my pipe and take a few puffs on it before it's lit. It has such a wonderful taste to it before it's lit. It tastes like raisin bread before you light it and it's just got such a great taste to it even before you light it it's just got a wonderful taste and then when you light it it's got a whole different taste to it which is still really really good and uh, it's got a light sweetness to it Uh, every once in a while you get a hold of those those little I call them sugar crystals I don't know what anybody else calls them but they're like these nuggets in there and they're some guys like to bust those up I can leave them alone and uh when you get those, you get this burst of sweetness in your smoke, and I love them. But they, uh, it's a wonderful tobacco, it really is. And, uh, it's one of those you, you don't, I don't think about while I'm smoking it's just it's just such a wonderful throwback kind of smoke it's a you, you know it was a, I never got to try the original and uh, and I've tried a couple of of the uh, The, uh, like this one and I think Sutliff has a has a uh, a blend that they make that's a uh, clone of it and uh, I mean I like them both and uh, but Mylon tobacco is my happens to be my I'm lucky enough to have it be my brick and mortar here and uh, they make just quality tobaccos they blend quality stuff there and, and uh, I really enjoy this one here and it's been a while since I've smoked it and uh, But I like to smoke these codger blends when I'm smoking a codger pipe, you know. And uh, and you don't get more codger than a 1950s doodler.
so I've been thinking that I may take a bit of a hiatus from the channel here for a little bit maybe a week week and a week and a half two weeks we are getting into serious home searching and uh, I don't have a lot to say on my channel lately I've noticed and uh, so I think I need to recharge a little bit and just come up with some you know some ideas and put my mind on other things and we are going through the loan process for the home for a, a home we don't have not picked one out yet but um, we have got that all started and uh, it's gotten pre-approved and so we could start actually looking earnestly for a house and uh, we're gonna go we found one we really really like but it which we really 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 like but it has some issues that we want to find out about and we were all set to actually put in an offer on this house and But we noticed a couple things, and then when we asked about them, we found out that there was an issue. And uh, it supposedly has been addressed. And um, so we want to see the report. see the engineer's report and everything on that and uh, before we do anything and and then there's another house that we really like too and uh, it's out both of these houses are in just peaceful areas just <laughs> we went out last night and drove to this one house that we're going to go look at tonight. And it's out and just, we went out last night and there were deer all over the, the yard. And, uh, I mean, you couldn't see a house around it, you know, from where the house was, you couldn't see a house around it. And... There were houses you just couldn't couldn't see them anywhere, and uh, yeah, the house is back, you know, a hundred yards off the street type thing, and. And just trees all around it, just everywhere, just trees. It's just all wooded area, and which is my ideal place. You know, Sadie's like, well, we don't have any neighbors. <laughs> I'm like, bingo. And uh, that's my dream house. And... Uh, because I kind of want to see my neighbors. Uh, and you can go get an apartment, honey. <laughs> we have neighbors. They're just... You can't see them because of the trees. And, uh... It's quiet, just so quiet out there, and 
I want to have nature. I want to see deers, and I want to uh, deers. I want to see deer. I want to see nature. I want to see animals. I want to see occasionally a bear, even maybe. I, you know, I want to see nature and. be able to have my smoker going without the neighbors complaining and I want to put my stereo on and have cream playing or Derek and the Dominoes or the Almond Brothers and not have a neighbor complaining you know some mountain I want to just be able to crank it up and not have anybody complaining about it, you know. But anyway, so that's what's going on. I, I may be taking a little bit of a hiatus here to focus on some important things. Not that this isn't important, but... We're getting excited, so... Focus on some really exciting things for our family. And if anything exciting happens, I'll definitely come on here and tell you about it, but... And I'm sure I'll be coming on here. If I come out here and have a smoke, I'm sure I'll do a video. So, because that's my, that's part of my tradition: smoke a pipe, do a video. So, but I've done, you know, over a thousand and fifty videos. So there's not much for me to say anymore. <laughs> We'll see what's going on. I'll catch you guys later. Yeah. I'm not going away. That's, I'm not going away. I'm just taking a little break here. I got a few doctor's appointments coming up and tomorrow and so I may be taking a a week off or so. Not gonna. I'm not gonna be scheduling any videos anyway. They may happen, but so if you don't see me for a little while, it's nothing bad happening. Catch y'all later.